Hey guys, what's up, and welcome to another episode of The Waystone. And today, I am fully geared out in diamond armor. Yes, that is right. I have, I don't know what I'm doing with the camera. Uh, I have Protection 3 dim Diamond Depth Strider 3 boots. Uh, I've got Fire Protection 4 Diamond Leggings. I've got a diamond chest plate. Sadly, it got thorns when I put Unbreaking 3 on it, um, but we, you know, it's whatever. And then we still just have Aqua Affinity on our thingy here. Um, and Llama Freak has lent us a Silk Touch pick, which is beautiful. Uh, and then we've got Silk Touch Shovel and this guy, which is Smite 5 Diamond Axe. I uh, thought that was a really good thing to have. And then Fortune 3 Diamond Pick. Uh, and then this guy, which I don't remember if I had, but little bow. Um, so... This episode is going to be interesting. We're going to be working uh, with Llama Freak and uh, <laughs> we're going to be working with Llama Freak and so this episode is going to be interesting. Uh, we're going to be working with Llama Freak and not Dov. Uh, that is Fuzro Duh. I figured that one out. I thought it was Dave, but then um, wasn't Dave. Uh, it's Dov. And uh, uh, I'm sorry, Dov. Not Dov. Yes. Sorry. Um, we're going to be working with them on the Waystone Tower, which is <laughs> is it's a pretty big project. Uh, it's it's going to be really cool, though. Um, so it's going to be a time lapse um, from it's going to be from multiple perspectives, but mainly uh, Llama Freak. This first portion, at least uh, Llama Freak and not Dov building up the um, Oh, you know, the, the main structure, uh, because I worked mainly on the landscaping for a lot of the main structure building. And, um, you'll see that in the end result. Uh, but yeah, so the main time lapse portion is the main structure of the build. I'm really trying not to give anything away. Uh, so it's going to be really cool. I wanted to go over really quick, both the armor update and, what I'm going to be doing to this area. So I'm just adding on to this area every so often. Um, and I had an idea. You can see it right there and there. So I was thinking, you know, I saw this granite and I was like, you know what? This granite gives me an idea. Not to have a granite roof. That would not be the most ideal, I don't think. Uh, it gave me the idea to have like veins of different rocks kind of wrapping around our structure. And so the first one I did was I added this, which is very, very close to what our house, uh, I really just like this block combination. Like this is like one of my favorite block combinations now. Uh, I think it just looks really, really good. Um, so this, I really like this. And so I was like, you know what? Let's make this the floor. And then I thought, you know, why not extend it and like wrap it a little bit up here? And so I thought that was a really cool idea to do, like to have some different organic like wrapping veins of different types of blocks. So imagine this would be like a crazy granite combobulation. I don't even know. Um, vein of stuff. And then this right here is diorite, and we have wrapped diorite from here near over here. And it just makes everything a little interesting. And so I'm going to actually, I might get rid of the andesite in here um, because we're going to have an andesite one as well, and I think that'll be good. There is an andesite chunk somewhere, like right there. Yeah, so there's a, like andesite right here. So you can't tell near as well with the andesite, but I think it's going to look good overall. Uh, so that is an update on this. I have also added uh, this little area. I don't know if I actually showed you this, um, but I made this stairway. Uh, it leads up here. It also connects uh, to this little tunnel. Just added it because I wanted a quicker way to get out. And so I added this little area. And if you go out, you get pushed up by soul sand. And there are a bunch of mobs, so we're going to go back down. And there's, I can't actually look over to the island because that's where the tower is. Uh, and speaking of the tower, I think it's time that we get into the time-lapse of 
what we're doing. So I'm going to sleep uh, because there's nobody on the server currently. And daytime. Yay. So without further ado, guys, I'm going to let you guys get on into the time lapse. I hope you enjoy it. I hope the end result's really cool. I'm really happy with it. Llama, Llama Freak and I definitely did some planning and stuff of it and not Dov as well. Um, and they've definitely put in a lot of work building it. And the landscaping hopefully is coming along pretty good. I think so. I think it's going to be really cool. And I think it's going to be a really great addition to this, uh, the beginning of this server. So the goal is to get all of it done. I'm not going to promise everything, but we'll see. So I'm going to stop blabbing. You guys enjoy this time lapse.
All right, guys. So I haven't done anything here, um, but we are about to go and look at what Llama Dov and I made. And I got to say, you've seen the time lapse. You've seen the tower and a little bit of the landscaping, but we have done some work after this. I am sorry that the my portion of it didn't really get into the um, time lapse, and that's because I didn't figure that the landscaping side of things was near as interesting um, as the tree itself. Um, but hey. I still think it was it's really cool um and so let's see the first thing you're gonna notice is well a giant freaking tree also llama has made a staircase that goes all the way up and wraps around it i think it's really cool and you can see we add we have started uh this i have started making a waterfall section here to join up into the ocean and I think it looks really, really good. I think you guys are going to really dig this because, I mean, we we certainly do. So you've got this little area. And, oh, look at it. Look at that. It's just so cool now. So we've got, like, a little river creek thing. This derpy bridge. Uh, this definitely... I'm sure this is going to change or we're going to do something different. But for now, we got a derp bridge. And then we added some more mushrooms. I didn't add any of the mushrooms. I'm pretty sure Llama uh, made the mushrooms. And he definitely made that one. Uh, I'm not sure about that one. But yeah, we altered this a little bit. Uh, the the Mainly, we just altered down, he, down below uh, of this mushroom. Uh, I don't remember who made this original mushroom. Um, but we altered that. Uh, so that the waterfall could be three wide and so that the waterfall looked a little more natural. Uh, we didn't want the want it to look like, I don't know, we didn't want it to be straight down. We like That's not very dynamic, and that's honestly not near as interesting as having a waterfall that actually like bounces off the rocks and stuff. But even It just moves over one block, but it's so effective. Uh, so yeah, it's really cool. I We... I gotta say, like, I personally, super happy. Like, this this is what a server, I feel like, should should do. Like, this is so cool. Look at this. The, it's the new Waystone Tower. And this, I don't think this is done. This is not complete uh, from, especially uh, the landscaping. We're going to be doing landscaping next episode. Uh, I definitely want to hammer down a lot of landscaping uh, around this area to really make, flesh it out. Um and to make it look really good. And then uh, we've got a co I've got a couple projects that I think we're going to be doing for a little bit um, that is more around spawn still. Uh, and I think that'll be cool. I really I want to start adding some little things like our little house here, but I don't really know what uh, because I'm really digging this uh, this type of stuff. So. If you guys have any ideas, I'd love to hear them. Uh, would love to hear your ideas because that'd be really, really cool. And let's see. What was I going to talk to you about? I was going to talk to you about something. I don't know. Let's look at this. Uh, so we've got this little area. And this is like, I think this might be one of my favorite things. Like just having the power to make this little creaky thing is so cool. Like... It's so effective, and it just looks so neat. I don't know. I'm really happy with this. I got it. I'll not take credit for this because I did this. Because I'm so great. No, I'm not. Um, but yeah, these these were brought by Dov. Definitely, this is, if you if you need pickles, you know where to find them. But yeah, this is really, really cool. Uh, whoever's uh, tunnel this is, sorry, we made it really hard to get to, but that's okay. And this is going to go somewhere. We're not really sure. We like made this area and I did, I had it kind of, I had it be grass, but I definitely, whoever made the call, uh, Llama or, um, 
I think it was Llama. Whoever made the call to clear it out and make it all water, I think that is a definite good call. I think that's a really good idea. So let's take a look-see up here real quick. This is going to probably be a shorter episode. I don't know how long the time lapse is going to be. Um, but yeah, let's take a look at this side. I also did not um, show the landscaping as much because it's very similar to what we just did in Bruin Build. And if you watched Bruin Build, then, ooh, diorite. That uh, wasn't supposed to be there. Um, if you watch Bruin Build, then you'll get the gist of it. Like, it's literally like the same thing. Um, it's just taking some coarse dirt, putting it there on the side, and then draping leaves and stuff to make it look all overgrown. And if you see cakes, that's probably thanks to Llama. I'm going to eat a little bit. But let's run up here. It is quite, quite a ways up. But we're going to make it all the way to the top. Uh, but this is super fun to work on. And the island is definitely coming along. Uh, it's super, super cool to see. Like, I really like playing with it oh, more than just myself. I really love Bruin Build, but definitely fun to play with more people. Um, but yeah, let's, let's, it's, it's going to take us a bit. Never mind. We're here. <laughs> uh, not, I don't know, really know what we're going to be doing here, but. I think it's going to be cool. So this, I mean, here's the waystone. Hello, waystone. Um, you can get on top of it, and you can get to the highest point in the land currently. Actually, no, you can't because I th think. No, you can. Never mind. This is the highest point. <clears throat> you can get here, here, and, and boom, highest point. Super cool. I'm happy with it. I think Llama and Dove are happy. I know Waffle's happy. He seemed happy. He while we were making this, he literally had his like he himself was watching it. And then I swear, like he had his camera account just floating around on us the entire time. This is terrifying. This is terrifying. This is terrifying. <laughs> oh, that was terrifying. Um, he had our, his camera account. I, I swear he had his camera account the entire time that we were making this. Uh, just floating around watching the progress as he either was sitting on that roof watching or he was doing something like on his other screen or I don't know what, but it, it was pretty funny. Um, but yeah, so that's what we've done. Uh, this is a really fun project, really cool. Uh, and I should, hey, let you know what? I'll show you the first idea I had that is basically this, but worse. Uh, just to wrap things up because I think that'll be fun. So let's hop over. We'll just do this now. Let's just hop on over to what is it? Single player. And then I think it's in our brew labs. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah. So that is not near as cool, but this was kind of the, the beginning idea of it. We originally were thinking like we want to incorporate the corals somehow. And it's an interesting build, but I'm not really good with trees. Like this looks derpy. Um, I'm not particularly good with trees. Uh, so I kind of let Llama take hold of that and run with it because he was far off. Oh, never mind. We are in. Never mind. I thought our texture pack was messed up, but nope, we're not. It's not messed up. Um, but yeah, I'm not good with trees, so I'm, I just left that to Llama and Dove because they are better with organics. I could have done it. It would just probably take me a lot longer. Um, but yeah, so let's hop back on over because it's much. I want to close it there. Much more fun here. Yeah, super, super cool. Really happy with it. Um, but that's going to do it for this episode, guys. And if it uh, ends up being shorter, sorry about that. But... I slightly procrastinated and this took a lot, a decent amount of time. And I can't do like time lapses like I normally do because I don't have two accounts. Uh, so the time lapse, I got to say thank you to, oh, fell in the hole. Got to say thank you to Llama for letting uh, me use slash we both used his um, camera account. Uh, 
definitely a help there to be able to give you guys a cool little time lapse of this area. And uh, yeah, so definitely shout out to him. If you haven't seen him and you like art stuff, definitely check out his channel. Uh, he's a great artist and he does some speed paints and stuff. And I'll definitely always shout him out whenever we get the chance. Uh, so yeah, we'll probably do be doing more and more col collab stuff with him. Uh, and I'd, I'd like to do more collabs with uh, even more people. So I don't really know who else to, but regardless, we are going to leave for this episode because I'm tired and it's 1 a.m. and I need to edit this. So thank you guys for watching. And if you guys like the video, leave a like in real life. Uh, and if you like what I'm doing and are excited to see even more of this crazy shenanigans stuff, uh, feel free to subscribe, join the little family we've got going here, and I will see you guys in the next episode.